Hey everybody, uh, another day, another reaction, and um, today we're excitedly checking out the latest We Butter the Bread with Butter track, so uh, if you're not familiar with this band, oh, you're in for you're in for an experience. Um, I, I don't even know how you describe what these guys are, they're like technical, electronic core, metal, um, with like death metal influences and stuff, but then they do all this like weird stuff in there. Um, it's just, it's chaotic and there's a lot of stuff going on. I actually did a reaction to the previous track they dropped um, a few weeks ago called 20 Kilometers an Hour, which is, you know, this wild film clip with scooters and stuff. Um, the song itself was nuts. The film clip was nuts. Uh, I'm kind of expecting with this track nice. Um, I assume from the upcoming album, it's going to be more or less the same type of vibe as 20 Kilometers an Hour, so... What is that? Oh, it's a toaster. <laughs> With the bread symbolism again, of course. Okay, we've got a we got a little uh, creepy horror music sort of intro going on. Hip hop? You got a, you got like a hip hop track? <laughs> this is a nice song. Straight up, um, this is different to 20 Kilometers Now. This has kind of got more of a riff-oriented feel about it, more groovy. Um, probably more of a standard-sounding song so far. <laughs> I love that chorus. <laughs> uh, I'd love to know what they're saying. I haven't looked up the lyrics, uh, obviously, because it's the first time I'm hearing it. But if anyone uh, knows what they're saying, let me know in the comments. I know they're saying nice. <laughs> I love all those weird sounds I do. Um, by the way, cool little part on the riff there is like walking up and down, like dun 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 dun. Simple and effective. Oh shit, we're building up. I can feel it. What? Hard sounds so creepy. What are they saying? Mm. Okay, well that's throwing me off that little gap. What a riff. Love that. Oh, nothing worse when the toast comes out of the toaster and then it falls onto the floor. It happens to me more than you'd think because uh, I generally have toast for breakfast. Um, wow. <laughs> uh, well, let's state the obvious. That track was nice. Um, that guitar riff, I love that guitar riff. Um, this band, how how fun is this band? Seriously, uh, they've been around for like ten years, but I feel like they've just had this. They've come into their own, and people are starting to notice how fun this band is. And not only that, but they they make really good songs. Like when they're not making super technical, chaotic death metal songs, like they just made a straightforward, you know, more um, 
I guess, you know, metal, metal focus track here with the chugging and stuff like that and the dark sort of uh, lead part in the back there. But you know, it's still quirky, but it kind of feel, felt a little bit more straightforward than what you're used to hearing these guys do. Uh, especially at 20 kilometers an hour. I mean, if that was the first time you heard this band, you'd be like, these guys are nuts. Um, but this song, I mean, it was, I was, I'm actually surprised, like, how straightforward it was. I mean, uh, still, still awesome. I'm not saying it's bad or anything like that. Um, I actually liked it more than 20 kilometers an hour, and I thought that was a good track. Um, you know, I love that kind of dark, little sinister, creepy vibe about it. Um, that guitar riff, and then the part towards the middle there with the, near the breakdown when they're walking it up and down, that dun 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 dun. Um, this band is such a good time. They really are such a good time. Um, you know, you can't really pigeonhole them. You can't really critique them. Um, they are what they are. Like, you know, they obviously don't take themselves too seriously. Um, but they're obviously top tier musicians. The vocals are always on point. Um, production's always on point. But, you know, by all measurable standards, um, they're a proper band. But obviously, you know, they have fun. And... I feel like, you know, in music, that's important, especially these guys have been around for 10 years, I feel. Um, you know, I feel like when I was, you know, going through a really kind of heavy music phase, um, you know, back in my later teenage years, I, I feel like I remember these guys were being heavier than they are now. Um, I can't really name any songs or anything like that, but I know they used, I feel like they used to be so much more like chaotic and like more of a, you know, um, crazy intensive sort of, you know, electronic core band than they are now. And they've still got the crazy elements, but um, I feel like tracks like this are just so much more accessible and not only that, but like if you saw these guys live, like catchy, simple hook in the chorus like that, you can imagine people in the audience going like, yes, everyone just yelling it out. Um, and someone told me actually in comments on the other reaction video I did that they, I don't think they've toured outside of Europe before. Um, which is a shame because I would love to see these guys and obviously being in Australia, it's a bit trickier. There's a pandemic still going on, but, um, you know, this band needs to get out and tour. Well, you know, as things start to open up, stuff like this, they, they would have no problem selling out a venue. No no doubt. Um, you know, you would go to one of these shows and you would probably have so much fun. And, you know, sometimes metal shows can be so, you know, insufferable because you've got just sweaty, you know, dreadlocks everywhere and just intolerable drunk people and stuff. Sometimes the vibe at a metal show can be, like, really off. I feel like these guys, you go to the show and it's like a party. It would be, it'd be legitimately be a party. You know, all the electronic little brake parts they put in there and stuff. Um, and just the fact you can mosh it so easily. I loved it. I absolutely loved it. Um, I'm, I think they've got an album coming out. I haven't actually checked, but it may even be out now. I really should look that up just in case. Um, so much fun. Let me know in the comments what you think of this band. Uh, you know, are you, have you recently discovered them or have you been listening to them, you know, for the last few years? I'd, I'd love to know kind of who is listening to this band and, you know, where, where pe what people think of them as well. So, um, yeah, we're going we're gonna to wrap this up there now. But, I mean, what a fun track. I love that. Um, I'm looking forward to the album, presumably, if they've got one coming out. don't even know if they announced one. Um, but I assume, they, I assume they do. Two tracks now. So, anyway, we'll, uh, we'll end the video there. But, if you um, as always, if you made it to the end of this video, I really do appreciate your time. And uh, until next time, stay safe.